So let's hear what I call psychobabble, right? So this is why the sisters, these these chakra princes, is crazy today and single. Now everybody know I coined the frame chakra princess. So I tell people chakra princess always got two three kids and never got a man. They're so spiritual, but ninety percent of them are single. It's because they're crazy when they get to talking like she about to talk. Can't no real man deal with no shit like that. With this crazy, crazy shit. Fucking psycho babble. Just listen. She's talking about the third eye. Now, first of all, there's no such thing as a third eye. That's just Hindu religious bullshit. And they re people usually re equate it with the third eye. Excuse me, I'm sorry. With the pineal gland. In which they really have, they, they have nothing to do with each other. One is real, one is fake. Pineal gland is real. <laughs> There's no such thing as a third eye. That's some Hindu religious bullshit. But watch her psychobabble. This is why our sisters is lost. Because she's the queen of the psychobabblers. She's the queen of the chakra princesses. And the grandmama of the chakra princesses is queen of Fua. Queen of Fua, Erica Badu. Got these girls all miseducated and wacko. So let's listen to the effects of the teachings of Queen of Fua and how they negatively impact black women to be crazy. <laughs> it's uh, time to turn it on. It's there waiting for you to pay attention to it. And uh, there are five doctors that you can use to turn on this. The switch, this pineal gland. Five doctors, you don't have to go anywhere else. Number one, Dr. Sleep. Get in the proper amount of sleep so that your circadian rhythm is on with nature's. No matter what city you're in, if you're going to sleep and if you can, go. Now, mind you, it looked like she needs some fucking sleep. This is ridiculous. 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. That's when the pineal gland releases the hormones that... Uh, revitalize the body and give you the hormonal, harmonic energy that you need throughout the day. Straight bullshit. That's not how the body works. It sounds good, but like, yeah, these women will listen to that and just believe it. Just off the strength. Somebody said it and it sounded good. They will never look it up and this is how they get brainwashed and gullible. Because to look that up, you have to research some science. That means you have to fucking read something. <laughs> Which people are not going to do because they like entertainment. They just listen to a video and listen to somebody talk. They won't fact check shit. And they'll fall for it and start believing it based off some quack said so. Some quack who know nothing about the human anatomy said so. <laughs> doctor, doctor exercise. Got to move something 15 minutes, 20 minutes a day. So that the blood can circulate all over the body. Doctor number three, Doctor Nutrition. Eat the right foods, the foods that are made for your body. There are so many ways to find out what that is. You can do some blood tests and eat for your blood type. You can wait a minute. <laughs> Minister Inky and Doctor Ali Muhammad, I think too, be teaching that bullshit. Eat for your blood type. <laughs> Your blood type ha ha requires a special certain diet. <laughs> like they actually know what to eat for your blood type. <laughs> it's the silliest shit. And people believe it's a thing called eat for your blood type. Because quacks, like Minister Inky and her, and people teach this kind of shit. Dr. Sabi's teachings, Queen Fool's teachings, or Dr. Africa's teachings. There's so many diets and ways to find out what's going on. There's no... Dr. Sabi, Dr. Queen, excuse me, Queen of Four, and Layla Africa. Three liars. Three habitual liars <laughs> who don't know what the hell they talking about. But everybody listen to them. Three of the biggest charlatans ever. All three of them. Miseducating black people on a daily basis. Entertain, I call them entertainers. Let's not know what's good for our bodies. The fourth doctor is 
Dr. Sun. You got to get the vitamin D. It's kind of like the game changer. It goes hand in hand with breathing. When you think of breathing, you're also thinking of sunlight and getting that sun on you. And the fifth doctor is Dr. Spirit. No matter what you believe, take a few minutes to be with the self. You know, even if that's in the bathroom at your job or in the car or uh, a teacher in the, in the, in the break room, uh, a DJ uh, in their booth. Take time to be with the self and breathe. Those five doctors are the keys to keeping that pineal gland open. <laughs> keeping the pineal gland open. <laughs> How do you open your pineal gland? You know, there's, 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 there's this anatomy teacher's I was just watching a, a video on a guy talking about anatomy and he had cadavers on the brain and he was showing the pineal gland and his purpose and stuff like that. <laughs> Nothing about what she talked about. She don't know what the fuck she talking about. And neither do the people who follow her. Neither do Queen Afua. They teach this bullshit. <laughs> and that's why all these women is crazy and single. Like most of the people, when women who follow Queen of Four, all single with kids, talking this crazy shit at home, and niggas is running away. Creating the hormones that the body needs in order to be vitally, spiritually, mentally healthy. Jesus. Jesus Christ. Abraham and Moses.